Hey everyone, welcome back to Iguana Gaming. I'm the Iguana, and today we are playing some Ark Survival Evolved Mobile Edition. Now, as you can see, I have done quite a bit of work here in the Redwoods on the base. Uh, we've got ourselves a few things built up, including some spike walls to kind of protect the area, a few gates. Um, these gates actually belong to my neighbor, not to me, but they do work to protect this area. And I've also got this little dino pen built up right here. And now this is an important dino pen because we now are going to put something in it. Um, I've been getting a lot of requests to tame Car Carnos on the channel lately, and so that is what we are gonna do. We are gonna go find ourselves, hopefully a high level Carno, and we are going to do our best to tame it up. All right. So, let's see, I do have a soothing balm on me, which I do plan to use. Um, I have the saddle, I have a few trank arrows, um, a couple of crossbows. I did unfortunately lose my ascendant bow, which was really good in the cave. Um, but we did make up a couple of crossbows to make up for it. And then of course I have some narcotics, which we may or may not need with the soothing balm. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and start looking here, and it may take some time to find a high-level Carno. Carnos are not too uncommon, but it is hard to find a high-level one at times. Um, luckily, they do kind of spawn all over the Redwoods area, so I have... That's a Spino. What level are you? Ten. Boo. Um... Anyways, so I do have a, I, I do plan to take some time to look for a good Carno. Um, it may take some time, but we are in the right area. Yeah, so I will bring you guys back when we find something worth taming. So I will see you in a little bit. Okay guys, we are back. And as you can see, this Carno right here is a level 130 male. And now that is pretty good. So I think we are going to go ahead and try to tame this particular Carno. Um, I probably can even get it to follow me up this way. There is a saber tooth there. Now I am on Carno Island. I will show you guys on the map um, maybe in a minute when I'm not quite so distracted. But essentially... It's a very dangerous place. Uh, there are a lot of things around here that want to kill you. And uh, it's very easy to die. So you definitely want to be careful if you come out this way. I'm like waiting for this saber to come and get me so I can... Yeah, I don't need you. And that was the level 15 Carno. Which I also don't need. Alright, now where did that level 130 go? I do have to be careful because if I hit it with my pike, I'm likely to kill it. Um, can I get on, please? There we go. All right, let's see. Where did it run off to? Okay, it's right there. That's not too bad. If we could land properly, that would be great. I want to land on top of a rock because Carnos are pretty strong. Um, I have decent armor. It's not the best, but it's decent. And I know we can land on this rock. Thank you. Alright. Where is that Carno? There he is. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and see if I can't hit him from here. It's a little bit far. I do have Trank Darts equipped. He is fighting a bunch of things. Ugh. Oh. If he dies, I'm going to be so mad. Why? Wait, that's a level 40. Where's my level 130? Oh, is he back over there? Yeah, okay, cool. Well, that's good. That's away from, like, the mosh pit of bad things. Um, can we get back on? Thank you. Alright. Let's see. Okay, so we have to go over here. Um, that's him right there. This is good. This is good. We're up in a high place. He can't get to us too easily. Um, there are a lot of different methods for taming Carnos. I prefer to just stand up somewhere high and uh, just pump them full of Trank darts. Or Trank arrows, even. 
Can I? No, that's not what I wanted. What? Why is it not firing? Like, okay, that's annoying. Oh, and a Rex. Great. This is all very good. This is all gonna go very well, I can tell. And that hit the rock somehow. Apparently there's a rock there. Yep, that's gonna hit the rock too. Great. This is going so well so far. The beautiful um, How to Tame a Carno episode. Gosh. Can you hold still? For like two seconds. There we go. Nope. If he stands right under me, I can't hit him because there's an invisible rock here. And that didn't count for some reason. That was like straight on. I don't know why it didn't count. Are you like climbing the walls? I thought I saw you climb the wall. I oh, got an arrow back. If he runs into the ocean, we might be in trouble. That should have hit. There's not that much drop on this uh, crossbow. It should have hit. All right, Carnos are a little bit squirrely. Um, they do have a sharp turn radius, which makes it a little hard to hit them sometimes. But we should be okay. Oh, that's what's happening. Of course, there's all sorts of bad things. Stop bothering me. I'm trying to do a thing here. That should have hit. Okay. It's very frustrating when things don't hit when they should. There we go. We will get him down. He is kind of a high level for this, but we will get him down. I have plenty more. I thought I had enough Trank arrows, but that may not be the case if um, if the game keeps desyncing enough that I keep missing. Like that should have hit. I have enough of an angle and that one wasted. Oh God, this game. I wish it wouldn't do this, like honestly. I would love to not have to bring a thousand more things than I need to tame, uh, just like a Carno. Seriously? Okay. This is annoying. I don't have, like, any more, um, stone arrows, so I may actually have to go and craft a bunch now, which is incredibly frustrating, because I don't have that many. There we go. Go ahead and craft a few things. And now the Carno's gone. Where is he gone? Oh, he's over there. He's trying to get to me. You know, it might be easier to stand underneath him. Um, I can take a few hits. I have quite a bit of health. As long as my Pteranodon is safe, I would be okay with that. God, they're so jumpy. Like, with the lag on the server, it's just enough that I'm worried about it. Just like that just enough lag he had already moved and it didn't register on my screen until it was too late all right go somewhere and hold still this is a cool looking carno honestly though um he's very pretty very red and green he should have been there okay <laughs> game please don't make me waste look at all those drank arrows in him please don't make me waste my ammo that should have hit. That really should have hit. It's so frustrating. Can you hold still for five seconds? In a place where I can see you. That'd be great. That'd be really good. I'd be happy. Hold still. That should have hit. That really should have hit. I'm never gonna get this guy down if nothing is gonna hit. And for some reason, I'm on the pistol whip and not on the fire. I don't understand. Ugh. And I'm on the rock. Can I hit his tail? No. Yes, but it didn't count. That's great. There. That count. Okay. All right. Oh, he's running. He's running. That means he's torpor. Good. Oop. Okay, let's run up back here. Grab Mr. Pteranodon. Um, actually, are there any arrows in here? No. Of course not. There's never arrows when I need them. 
And it's getting dark, which is extra great. Okay, um, let's just come sit right here. That's the level 40. That's not the one I want. Where's the one I want? Oh, great. I just need to protect. Can we hit, please? Thank you, screen. Yep. Everything's going all south. This is great. Don't hit my... Oh, my God. Okay, we need to get out of here. That's... No, nope. let me through. Oh, my gosh. Bad idea. Bad idea. That's a really high-level Rex. Okay. Let's move. Okay, we're okay. He didn't hit us. Um, rethinking my strategy here. Because that Carno is just gone. I don't know where it went. Took my eyes off of it for a second. I really wanted to tame it. Dang it. Where'd it go? I need that Carno. I need it back. It was right here. It was running. It didn't run into the ocean. Ah, there he is. That's him. That's him. Yeah. Yeah, you attack me. I'm okay with that. As long as that wreck stays over there, we're okay. We can take care of him later. Um, I may actually go around to the other side. The Pteranodon can take a, tuple, a couple of hits. Um, not too many. But hopefully we won't be here that long. I'm just gonna plug arrows into this guy. A little faster would be great. I really hate that reload bug. I really do. Quit making me waste arrows and time. Dang it. You put it in there. <sighs> like, it, it goes to reload automatically, but it doesn't actually do it. So it just takes twice as long to actually reload your crossbow as it should, which is very frustrating. It doesn't actually waste your ammo. I figured that out. All right. I like this, whatever's happening right here. He's kind of bugged out. Um, and he's not moving, which is great. This is very good for me. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, you stay. You stay. I want you. You're my friend. No. He's going to run over by that Rex, and I'm going to be in trouble. No, I hate that bug. It takes twice as long. Okay. No. No, 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 Rexy. Leave me alone. Leave Toothless alone. Yeah, I know you're high level. You're scary. Sure. Alright. Carno. Silly Carno. Okay, this is the Carno. No, no, no. If you run into the water, I swear, you need to go down. And you need to go down not in the water. Thank you. Here. I'm gonna, like, land between him and the water. No. 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 Turn around. Turn around and run that way. Ugh. Yeah. There you go. There you go. Keep going. Yes. Run into the rock. Okay. Maybe a couple more. He, if he stays glitched onto this rock, I'll be okay. Really, I should have probably done some sort of um, trap taming. No, 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 I need to hit him. Yes! Dang it, I hit him! Why? He's gonna lose taming effectiveness since I hit him one too many times. Can we please kill this? Thank you. My screen gets warm, and then it doesn't work, and then everything's bad. I don't even care that you're level 110. I have a level 130. I don't even care. I'm not gonna do this again. You die. You die. Great. Ugh. Dang it. The lag. I'm so mad that I hit him. I'm not gonna wake him up, though. It's not worth it. I'm gonna go ahead and grab Toothless here and bring it close. Close, but not too close. Um, actually, I think I took care of most of the bad things. 
except for this bird. Die. I don't need you either. Can you hold still, please? I have enough problems. I don't need you causing more. Now the good news is um, we do have raw prime meat. So what I'm gonna do is really quick, go ahead and use this soothing balm, which will save some of the effectiveness. And then I'm gonna go ahead and give it the prime meat and then the regular meat. So, okay. It's not even hungry yet, that's great. All right, we'll have to see how this goes. Um, yeah, I have plenty of spare meat on, on the bird here. I kind of want to tame that Rex, but um, we're not quite high enough level for that yet. All right. I'm so bummed about that extra hit. It was just one too many Trank arrows. Because he went down right as I was firing. I didn't know how close to unconscious he was, and it's hard to check with Carnos. But that's okay. Um, this Carno will still come out a pretty good level. Um, I am going to have to figure out how to get it back onto the mainland and all the way over to my base. It is quite a ways, but um, I do think we can do it. And obviously, Toothless can fly and follow us. Oh, cool. 35%. That's going to do really well. All right. So stats. Um, the health is pretty good. Stamina is not bad. The oxygen looks mid-range to low, which is awesome. And then the melee, eh, eh, I don't know if that's high or not. Um, Carnos aren't really, aren't really a fighting creature so much. They're kind of an upgrade from a raptor. Um, they just look really cool. I love Carnos and I really hope they get a TLC in the PC version of the game soon because I would absolutely love to see what they could do with a Carno if it was, um, TLC passed. All right. So I'm going to hang out here for a minute. Um, it probably will not take long, but I am going to go ahead and just wait for this guy to tame up and I will bring you guys back in just a minute when we have that done. Okay, guys, we are back. This Karno is up and even though it did lose some levels, um, it is still pretty decent at a level 187. Uh, 3,000 health, which is pretty good, especially considering that our raptor, even after pumping health, has, um, I think it's only like a little over a thousand. So this Carno is actually pretty decent. I do like it. Um, I love Carnos, very much so. Yeah, we look really cool. All right, so it is up. Um, I did run its stats. It's pretty average on everything, which is not entirely unexpected. Um, yeah, but it's a good little Carno. I think it's going to be decent for, like, wandering around on, uh, in the redwoods and maybe gathering some meat and doing things like that. All right, now the trick is getting it back home and doing a little hunting along the way. So I think I'm going to wait until it's light, um, just so that I can see a little better because we are going to have to, like, sneak around the island and try to avoid that really high-level Rex. I don't want to kill it because I'm hoping someone will tame it, because it actually seems like a decent Rex. Um, yeah, and everything else here, we should be able to handle just fine. So I'm going to have Toothless follow us, and we are probably going to build a raft to get back across the water. That's kind of my that's kind of my feeling on that. Um, I don't think it's going to be too safe to try to swim. It is quite a ways from Carno Island back to the mainland. Yeah, so I will catch you guys um, in a little bit when it's light and we are ready to adventure back towards the Redwoods base. Okay guys, we are back. Um, I have made up a raft. It is a little bit frightening looking. Uh, I'm not entirely sure that this is going to work. Rafts are still pretty buggy on Arc Mobile, so there's a good chance the Carno will fall off if we are not careful and that we will lose absolutely everything. Uh, hopefully that is not the case, but it could be. Like right there, he, he kind of moves back on the raft and it scares me. And then he bounces back, so this may take a while. Um, uh, he's like, he's not actually falling off the raft, but it looks like he is. Oh, and that's an alpha something, 
which is great. It's exactly what you want to see. It's like an alpha megalodon right underneath you and the carno you're trying to safely get back. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that red glowy thing in the water, I don't know if that's... It's probably a megalodon. Oh, this is so terrifying. Please don't fall off. I'm just gonna like inch my way. Inch. Carno, I swear, if you fall off, I'm gonna be so mad. I will be so mad if it glitches him off the raft. And then whatever that thing is kills it. That would be bad. That would be really bad. Ugh. Okay. I think we have to just go for it. Um. God. <laughs> is that an Alpha Rex? It doesn't look like a Megalodon. That looks like it might be an Alpha Rex, which is even worse. Um, because the Rex could chase us back to shore. The Megalodon has to kind of stay at sea. Oh, dear lord. Ugh. I'm pretty sure it's a lag issue. Um. Oh, no. Don't crash. Don't crash. I just need to make it back to shore. I just need to make it back to shore. I can handle everything else from here. This is close enough. Even with the aloe. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's only hugely terrifying. Okay, that's, yeah, it's good enough. We're just gonna abandon this raft here for now. Ugh. We are gonna go ahead and run our way back around the island through Smuggler's Pass and back towards base. Ugh. Okay. So that's mildly terrifying. Um, and for everyone who has asked if there are alphas on the mobile game, uh, yes, as you can see, there are alphas on the mobile game. Okay, so there are also aloes, which is not, not ideal. Hopefully we're strong enough to take everything on. I'm not entirely sure. Eh, it's level 50. He doesn't have a lot of health. He looks really cool, though. I love that black and red. That's a really cool color. Yeah, okay. It's only level 5. We got it. And now we have everything else trying to take a bite out of us, which is great. As long as they don't kill the Pteranodon, I'm okay. I just want them attacking me and not Toothless. Um, Toothless doesn't have a lot of health. Toothless is meant to be like a travel mount, not a not a battle mount. Okay, that's one down. All right, if we just run away, we should be okay for a while. Those RGs aren't very fast. There are a lot of things, but they're not fast. Man, I, I think they're over-spawning, honestly. I've seen so many RGs on the map, and it really seems like there's too many. All right, can we not pause to poop? That would be great. Do we have all the RGs on us? Oh, we have a few. We have a few coming after us. That's okay. Gah. Tasty, eat the raptor. No, don't hit the dimetrodon. Dimorphodon? Dimorphodon. Said the wrong word again. People keep calling me out on that. Uh, sometimes I say the wrong word, guys, and I do apologize for that. Um, I can't help it. Sometimes I am just trying to play the game, and I'm not always focusing on making sure I'm using the right words. And it does result in some really weird word choices. Alright, let's keep running. Okay. Oh my gosh, we have literally everything on us. Okay, we can fight the raptors. I just, I want the RGs to go away. Why are they still following me? They're so hard to fight because they just... Ugh. Okay, that one wasn't too bad, but normally... They're really mean because they float up in the air and then you can't hit them. No matter what you do. Can we please kill you? It would be nice. It would be really nice if we could kill you. Yes. That's beautiful. I'd like to kill you too. Okay. Um, so I have Toothless doing what I want, which is following me. So I'm also going to... That's not it either. Um, okay. I'm going to go ahead and level up... Let's level up health. I'd like to get that up to like 5k. 
And then I'll be pretty comfortable with where it's at. Man, we already have a lot of stuff. Um, so I'm going to go into my options menu, and I am going to change the controls of my right multi-tap to this reload alt attack 2 and apply. And so now we should be able to do the headbutt attack. Um, maybe? Oop, nope, it's the first one. Okay. Never mind, I was wrong. Karno only has two attacks, so all you have to do to get the second attack is swipe up on the left-hand side of the screen, which gives a headbutt, which is very cool, and uh, does a lot of knockback, which is really nice in a lot of cases. Okay, so we're gonna keep running this away. We are headed towards Smuggler's Pass. It is... Oh, that's a decent level saber, but we have a better one, and we are going to breed an even better one pretty soon here. I'm gonna go ahead and eat this one. Can we, you know what? Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Cool. So we're gonna run this way. Alright. Okay, I forgot to show you guys on the map, I realize. Um, so we were on that island in the upper right-hand side of the map. That island all over there, it's, uh, we call it Carnivore Island or Carno Island. It's um, it's a pretty deadly island. There's nothing but carnivores spawn there. So if you're new to the game, um, don't go there, <laughs> I guess. Uh, there is a cave over there as well. So if you're not new to the game, it's, um, it's a good place to go and tame certain types of carnivores like Carnos, like Rexes, um, and Argies, and Sabres as well. But it is hard to get stuff from there back to the mainland or can be, um, and right now I don't trust rafts at all because of the lag on the server. It's just, just bad enough that it's kind of a problem. Nom. Nom, nom, nom. Tasty, tasty raptor food. Can we eat you, please? That dodo has purple hair, and I like it. I'm gonna let him live, because he has a purple head, and that's pretty cool. Okay. So we're getting pretty close. Um, let's see. Let's see. I don't think there's a ton else that is going to be bad up in this area. We're just running through Smuggler's Pass right now. Uh, so as long as we avoid Therizinos, we should be okay. The only other thing that spawns in here that's super dangerous is Aloes, but there weren't any when I was in here earlier today, so I'm not too worried about it. There are quite a few raptors, but those are, like, squishy now. They're so easy. I'm really glad, I must say, that the TLC pass on the raptor hasn't come to mobile because... Oh, there's an aloe. Great. So there are aloes. Um, fabulous. Well, mm, if they aggro on us, we may have a problem, but otherwise we're just going to run past them. Yep, I'm being a coward. I don't want to lose this Carno after all the uh, trouble I went through to find him. It did take a while. I did fly, like, halfway across the map, as you can see. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Swim. Cool. Oop. We're stuck on a rock. We are. We're stuck on a rock. Man, I do really like Carnos. Um... Anyway, oh, I was talking about the Raptor TLC pass. Uh, so I'm really glad it hasn't come to mobile because of the pounce ability. Um, so for anyone who has played PC or knows anything about the PC version of Ark, where there has been the TLC pass Raptors, they can pounce on players, like pounce them off of mounts, and pin them to the ground and kill them. Uh, and they also have a pack bonus buff thing. So... If you are um, a mobile player, you should kind of hope that the TLC pass does not come to Raptors on this game, because that would be terrifying. I can't imagine trying to deal with a creature that can like just knock you out of the air, especially with all the lag on the servers right now, um, and how fresh the game is. Like, I don't want anything that can knock me off a mount. Like, that's just, that's the absolute worst thing that can happen. Especially on a mobile game where it's already tricky to get anywhere and to get anything done. 
Okay, we are getting really close to base now. Yeah, let's go through here. I'm gonna think, I think I'm gonna run up around that side because there is that base between here and my base um, that I don't think I'll be able to get through. So I will have to go around, which is okay. Let's go ahead and level something up. The stamina is actually not bad. Um, yeah, and this is after the devs have just updated the game, so um, the leveling up menu has changed for anyone who's noticed. It's a little bit easier to use now. Um, I didn't think it was bad before, but apparently some people didn't like it. I don't mind it, so I guess it's fine either way. Cool. Oh, and also, I'm tap and holding, and I'm not dismounting. I'm not dismounting at all, and that's because in this update, they have enabled an option under controls, if I can scroll here, the long press dismount. I disabled that. I unchecked that box, and I love it. I am no longer going to randomly jump off of my mount in the middle of a cave or in the middle of a fight with something that's really high level that could kill me. Oh, it's so nice. I'm so happy that that feature has been added. That little tick box is the best thing in the world. I'm pretty sure. All right, let's kill this terror bird. No. No. Where are you? He's being like a coward. Come here. Quit attacking my bird and attack me. I'm the harder one to kill. And for some reason, he's almost but not quite dead. Don't hit my bird. No, and the Mega is on him. Ugh, that's gonna be a pain. I'm gonna have to, the Mega Nura are really hard to get rid of if they're on like a passive creature or a flying mount because he flies off and then I can't reach the Mega Nura to kill it um, so that it's not bugging him. Very much a pain. Okay, so we are almost back at base now. This is great. And there's another Carno, and who wants to bet he's high level? I oh, know, we're okay. That is a really cool snail. We are going to tame a snail here pretty soon because I want to get the Akatina paste. Um, snails are incredibly useful, if you did not know, because they produce Akatina paste. And Akatina paste acts like cementing paste. Like, it's pretty much exactly the same as cementing paste. Um, and snails produce, like, a ridiculous amount of it very quickly. So I am super looking forward to taming a snail in the near future. We do have to do a little bit of cooking first because they take sweet veggie cakes. Um, and those are, they aren't like the hardest thing in the world to make, but they can be a challenge. All right, we're going to go down here. And it's okay. A little bit of fall damage is not too bad for us. There's another Carno. You know, there were no Carnos here earlier. That's why I went all the way over to Carno Island. There weren't any. I'm so mad. <laughs> there are always things when I think that there are no things. It's great. Cool. I see it. I see this. We just need to run around. That's it. This is the other person's base. Uh, my entrance. Ooh, lag. A little bit further up here. Just gonna kind of show you guys from the ground because it is a little different. Um, I did line these cliffs with spike walls, which is awesome because it should prevent most things from falling into that area. So once I start building up a few more outbuildings down there, um, hello dire bear, then then we should be pretty safe in this little pit. Um, we won't have dinos falling in on top of us, so I should be able to leave just a couple of things on neutral, and then we should be all set to go. All right, let's... Okay, I am pushing the stamina thing a little bit hard, but this is this is the entrance. Um, so we have a couple of gates here, pretty great. Yeah. Oh, it's beautiful. And now we're back at base. Um, there are still a lot of dangerous things in this little area. Um, mostly because I need to build up if I want them to stop spawning in. But we do have this, and nothing should spawn inside this ring. 
if I'm not mistaken. It should be safe. So we are going to go ahead and leave the Carno in this little uh, pen area that I have built for him, which is awesome. Cool. Uh, and a Sarko's trying to get in, which is great. A couple of Sarkos. There's always Sarkos here. It's a little ridiculous. I haven't seen any high level ones. I did see a level 150 Capro the other day, but it was trying to eat me, and so I had to kill it, and I felt really, really bad because I wanted to tame it. Um, we are going to do some Capro taming pretty soon here. Uh, I think we need to get started on some water mounts, and Capros are a pretty good first option for that. And I think I like them better than Sarkos because they're a little bit quicker. Um, on land, anyway. Ooh, lag spikes. Oh my gosh, that was bad. Okay. <laughs> um, uh, that's really bad. The frames are pretty terrible right now. Alright. But we did it. Uh, we set out and we accomplished our goal. We tamed ourselves a Carno. So I think that's going to do it for this episode, guys. Um, I hope you did enjoy. If you did, please remember to hit that like button. It seriously helps me out. And if you want to see more content like this, you can, of course, subscribe. And all of my Discord and social media are linked in the description below if you are interested in joining any of that. So yeah, I will catch you guys in the next one. Signing off, this is the Iguana. Got Capro on us. Kill this guy real quick. Die. Die. Alright. I'll see you guys later.